I just fly the drone and it was windy uh, trying to catch it and look it is very sharp nice cuts from the propellers I can tell you I think I will start to wear a glove next time <laughs> And what I, do you think? And I think we should uh, really try and fix this pole to grab it with. Yes, we will. But, um, yeah, blood. Oh. But um, it's good, good to have a wife and that ha has yeah. been a nurse, but yeah. it's like a very long time since you were a nurse. But that's, I guess. But I know how to put on the plaster. Yeah, but it was for premature born baby Please, you will yeah. work so so I could put in a needle in the premise as well yeah so let's uh, put on some and the, 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 the good thing Lolita is coming there and and there is a doctor and a nurse on, on board on that boat as well and so. a surgeon yeah and yeah a surgeon nurse Lolita is here and we will oh, we will uh, go into um, the island and have a look on the ruins but you see they have started to build or renovate the houses and, and build up I guess it belongs to the family who once lived here before everyone left Jeanette will tell you more about the history later but I think we go over there somewhere and uh, what can you tell me about the island Inishki Island. Inishki or Inishki. Or Inishki Island. In Gaelic, it is an island for geese. Uh -huh. they for say. geese? Geese, they say. Island of geese. So I read that there are actually living two people on the island now. And and around 15 during the summer. But oh, that would be so lonely. Yeah. You and me on a deserted island the whole year round. But you have, summer. they have fixed up some of the houses. Yeah. So we are on the beach and Jeanette is uh, cleaning her feet. But uh, the tide might catch her up because you have to jump from the stone. Otherwise you are, you are tide locked. What? Uh oh, the tide is coming. Woo! <laughs> now we'll see. And uh, the beach was really hard. The beach was really hard, but suddenly the one wheel, it got soft. But I think maybe we'll take it up a little bit more when we have the shoes on. Go and have a look at the houses and the ruins. Ah, oh, Lolita is coming there. Should we wait for them? Yes, of course. Is somebody angry at us? I the bird know. there. I don't know if they have a nest here or something. But he wasn't here from the beginning. No, he's maybe it angry because you took his stone, maybe. It <laughs> reminds me of the Arctic terns in Svalbard that they were attacking us. Yes, they were. It's not a bad beat, eh? Uh, the, the sand is unbelievable. Welcome to nice. the Caribbean. Yeah, it's just that you have a lot of clothes to be in the Caribbean. Yeah. Uh -oh. Hey! Hey! If you carry it a little bit up, because I have my shoes on, so I can't help you yet. <laughs> Here are the uh, ruins of uh, the village. A tragedy took place here on the 28th of October 1927. And uh, there were 44 fishermen that went out at sea and then got caught in a storm. So they waited on land for the first storm and it went away and then they went out and was totally surprised by the second storm. 44 fishermen, young, and uh, they uh, uh, were washed up on land. They were in rowing boats, sailing boats, had no chance in the storm.
And since fishery is a family business, these uh, families never recovered. So by 1930, they all left and uh, went elsewhere. Now we know that there are two people living here full time all year round. Possibly they go on vacation. I hope. It must be very deserted here otherwise. Uh, it must be very um, lonely here. And then uh, in the summer they say it is 15 people living on the island. But mainly now it's uh, uh, land for sheep. So they have the cows. When I see I go around because there is a toro. A toro. Two. Oh, you say one is a toro. Yes. We say hmm. They are all toros. They are not cows, actually. Yes. You can't get milk from these guys. Right. This one is ruling. I hope a he's not getting at us. With his children. Another female. There is a female. Yes. Ah, oh, it's a good thing. Maybe they are guarding her. So we are just anchored outside, and there is, yeah. But I, we haven't seen any people here, so I guess they are not here now. The two ones that are living here. And Jeanette told you the story, the sad story, when they left the island, never recovered after the accident with the fishermen. And uh, and that was also from the... So there is an island there, which is called North. There is just a small gap in between. So they were, there is also an old settlement. Yeah, this is an interesting place, I must say. And now they want to walk up the hill. And why not? Good exercise. So this looks like an old dam or something that they had. So this was probably like a little lake and they cut it off there to keep fresh water for them. And down there is the houses. They wanted to have a little test on their mother there. You want a leg? <laughs> you want to have a leg? A, sh a sheep leg. I, I, I have a knife. <laughs> ah, maybe. Can you show? Yes. <laughs> Interesting to see the, the walls here. Just a lot of stone and then there is a bigger stone to make the window there. And maybe we can look here. The door, how it's made. Tick, tick, tick. I think this must have been like a fireplace or something. It's a lot of work to put this up, huh? It's like like concrete. Show sure, is uh, 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 like uh, kalk. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Uh -huh. Yeah, but that is kind of concrete. concrete. You make you make. Uh, Cement? Yes, with concrete. Uh, which, uh, with, with, is it chalk, chalk in English? Yes. Kalk in Swedish? Yes. Oyster so so the bird that is a little bit angry at us is an oyster catcher. Yes. And in French it was? Vitrier. Vitrier. Uh -huh. And he's, yeah. Yeah. he's a little bit mad at us. He sings very strongly. Yeah. Keep away Always. from me. Yes, yes, yes. Who lives in there? A fox? Uh -huh. No, I think no. Uh, rabbit. Rabbit. Oh, yes. but it's very big. Yeah. No, 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 it's rabbit. rabbit hole. Yes, rabbit. But it's a very there big is rabbit no, hole. There is no fox here. No. No. Because the, the Irish uh, fox. The, the man, Pum. Yeah. Yes. Because, because the sheep. <laughs> the little sheep. Yes, of course. But with her. That was stupid of me. No. No, didn't you know that the French, they eat everything? Oyster catcher, yes. frogs, Oyster. oysters, 
Legger sheet. Legger. Snail. Snail. They eat leg of calf as well. Yes. yes. But I learned today. Leg of calf. That's I like. have a lot to learn to cook. It's a grey morning here at Inishkia, which we visited. Yeah. Yesterday. I think they pronounce it in Inishkia. Uh huh. I don't know. Are you a specialist in? I read in up on Gaelic. Gaelic yesterday. Oh, okay. In of course you did. Island of the geese. Hmm? And uh, today, I think it will be a long day mm. because we will make like. 75, 80 mm. nauticals mm. to um, Killebegs. Killebeg, yeah. Mm. And we're actually going into a marina. We maybe don't know because... Maybe tomorrow anyway. If there is room for us. Mm. We couldn't call them. No. There is no uh, telephone number. No BHF, nothing. So we mm. just have to go there, but you can anchor there and anyway, uh, as well. So it's good. Mm. Yeah, and um, we have prepared the seabed, mm -hmm. so we can have a little snooze. snooze and uh, which is very nice when it is such a long trip, day trip, and it's raining. Yes, I will try to show you out here. Look, mm -hmm. the Irish weather. And I get tired just by seeing the rain, mm. so it's good that we have a seabed to go to. But uh, it was uh, fun to go uh, sure, yeah. uh, on Inish Kia. Mm. And it's uh, a it nice uh, yeah. small island. And mm. it was also interesting to see that they started to build up the houses again. Yeah. So there was like one, two, three, maybe three, yeah. two. But had the weather been nice and sunny and... I mean, I could have stayed here for a couple of days just to yeah. relax and have a walk about. Yeah. And if the water would, ha would have been warmer. Mm. It now it was only like. Because the water. beach was like maybe almost as Bahamas. <laughs> <laughs> that we don't know, but it looked definitely like Caribbean. Yeah. So we. Anyway, we soon we will pick up the anchor and then the long day starts. Yes. So it's time to leave, or not exactly to leave yet, but we will take up the anchor, but I think first I will take up the same bag. Time for the anchor, but first we have to take off the snubber. There we are. A little snubber hook. It's off. And we are off. We're just waiting. We need to go around there. There is a shallow. You can really see it breaking out there as well. The shallow end. The sails are up and we are yeah, kind of flying. We are doing eight knots or something like that. Or seven and a half at least. But Jeanette, you said something about rain. We won't have any rain I can see. No, you mentioned the word rain, and it started to rain. Oh, did it? Yes. So I won't come out there. No, uh, maybe you stay inside then. No, it's not much rain, but it's, it's a grey day, I can tell you. But I think it will be a quick sail for us. Okay. Yeah. Do you like speed? Yes. And this I is speed. This is the speed. Through water, and I think we can trust it. We are figuring out the calibration. So we are doing, yeah, eight and a half, nine knots, even over ground uh, on the GPS there. So it's good. it is fast. It's fast. It's lovely, fast. even though it's raining. Mm. Fast as a shark. Yes, but even though it's raining. 
What do you know about that? You've been under the no, no, hood. No, no, oh, okay, so you get something on your... Oh, you can see it on your boots that it's raining. Are you not uh, happy with the weather? I think this this month on Ireland's wild Atlantic coast will go to history. It's been grey, and then the moment the sun comes out, we are we're so happy. It's unbelievable for about three hours, half a day, a day. Yeah, yeah. It, we have had uh, a rainy, blowy month yeah, here. <laughs> yeah, but we have had some good days as well. Absolutely. But uh, and we can count them on one hand. <laughs> <laughs> So, what you say now is like you are dead set that we will turn south after yeah. Ireland or not yeah, even go up yeah, to yeah. Scotland. Uh, you want to have some well, sunshine and vitamin D? I can think uh, of uh, staying uh, a short while in Scotland only to meet our boreal friends. And then like and then full speed... Uh, down south. Yeah. yeah Maybe we, stopping court. Yeah. If Ed is there, otherwise we could just scoot on over to uh, Sunshine. <laughs> yeah, and where would that be? North Spain? North Spain that would or like to South be. France? Or South France, yes. We still have the Sub de Lon to go to. Yes. Never been there. No. And I then we can shop some French goodies before we set off to Spain. Yeah, good plan. Can we make it happen like tomorrow? <laughs> Mm. No, we have to come up first so we can go around. Uh, yeah. Oh, you're right. First we need to go into uh, Killebegs and uh, sit tight for a couple of days when the big wind and rain blows over. Just again. But we have done that so many times now. <laughs> so, I can do some knitting and you can do some cutting. <laughs> Always think on the bright side of life. Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da.